52 children have drowned in Texas so far this year. And to give you some perspective, there were a total of 75 child drowning deaths last year. Melissa Correa is live in Midtown with a gadget that could save your kid's life. Good morning, Melissa. Hey, Ron, good morning. I, at this point, every safety measure is worth a try because according to the state's stats, Harris County leads Texas with nine child drowning deaths so far this year. The youngest, a one-year-old boy who drowned in his apartment complex pool. Houston's Apartment Association is teaming with the YMCA for free swimming lessons. 55 complexes are participating. You can call your leasing office for more information. Everyone from kids to parents to those who work with children should know five basic swimming skills how to get in and out of the pool floating on your back swimming forward treading water and being able to go underwater you can also turn to technology one of the things that we do with our children is they actually wear these little bracelets called the my buddy tags okay. um, and if they're submerged for more than 10 seconds in the water an alert will go off on any cell phone that you set it to or email so if one of my children does happen to go underwater while I am not with them, I will get an alert and I'll be able to find them. Make sure when someone is always watching kids when they are in the water, even if the children know how to swim. And it's a great idea to learn CPR. To give you some perspective, one of the 11 child drowning deaths. Let me backtrack there to give you some perspective of the 11 child drowning deaths that have happened in Houston so far this year. Seven of them happened in pools. The rest happened in ponds. The state of Texas taking water safety very seriously. The Department of Family and Protective Services just spent $1 million on an ad campaign. Help parents hope for children. It's warning folks about water safety and the risks when you don't know how to swim. We're live in Midtown. Melissa Correa, KHOU 11 News. All right. Thank you so much, Melissa.